Hey guys, it's me Blair Hastings with FPTV Open Mic, Make Your Voice Heard Edition. And today I got some really cool people here um, all around me from um, Day Vision Films, Michael Day, Jason Sewell, David Anthony, Marissa Dedner, Sarah Wild, and Day Vision's Michael Day. How are y'all doing today? Great. I'm good to see you. Good. Awesome. <laughs> so the reason why I have these folks on is that they are a part of a short film um, from Day Vision with Michael Day um, called Focus. Um, so Michael, tell me a little bit about Focus. Uh, Focus is really um, just sitting and addressing the um, issue of the pay gap between um, men and women across America, specifically African-American um, women, where um, I think Black women make 61 cent of a, a white man's dollar. And so uh, what we wanted to do with Day Vision, we wanted to make it funny, but we wanted to make it very funny. So um, we centered it around a um, aspiring main anchor. Um, she's been reporting at um, the news station for quite some time now. And there's this big promotion coming up. And so she uh, leans to her best friend and her love interest for support to um, get advice on how to secure this uh, position. And I have the best cat. Like all four of these, all four of these actors are like best. So we, we had a great time. <laughs> That's great. I, I do agree that you have a lot of really cool um, characters on this um, film, not only in real life, but also on the film. So, Marissa, I had a question for you. Um, why did you pick this role? I know it's a very uh, new role for you in acting. Yeah, it is. It was uh, actually my first uh, role in a film. So I was really excited to play it. Um, I had the honor and the privilege to play the role of Denise. In the film, um, I had a great time, um, but I wanted to play this role because um, I was just really excited to tell this story. Um, like Mike was talking about, um, we wanted to address uh, the gender pay gap. And I felt like as a black woman, I really wanted to be the one to tell the story and um, to get that message out there to the people because, you know, that's what we do um, as entertainers. We, you know, want to, to send messages and, um, you know, just inspire people. And I was really excited to do that with Day Vision. Nice. I, I hope that you did exactly what you wanted, and I know you worked really hard on this role. Um, Jason, I have a question for you. How do you think that this short film will impact others? Wow, I hope it does more than just impact other short films. I hope it raises awareness about the, the pay gap that we're talking about. So, I mean, first of all, props to Mike and being bold, I think, and coming up with not only the idea and the, the vision for this film, but also uh, the execution. Um, it's not always an easy subject matter to talk about what this film uh, addresses. And so um, I hope that, number one, some eyes are opened, uh, not only in our community, but where this wherever this film is seen, to what that pay gap is and that at least at least it starts a conversation about how we can do better how we can sort of shorten that pay gap and it doesn't have to be so wide and we should be thinking about those things anyway but then also in terms of filmmaking, I would love to see this storyline carried out through other filmmakers. Perhaps other filmmakers watch this and are inspired and want to tell um, a similar story or a story about those who are disenfranchised or those who maybe aren't being uh, represented equally. And so maybe it opens some eyes and opens some doors for folks to continue that. So that would be my hope uh, for this film. Definitely a good hope for um, this film and for future films um, surrounding our area. Um, Sarah, I know that you were casted as the best friend uh, for Marissa's character. Um, how did that role um, affect yourself and uh, the other actress here? Um, well, it was really cool because the whole thing is just an educational experience. You know, you learn not just more about acting, but about how you can represent others and how you can help others, you know, have more of a spotlight and have a voice more. Um, but, you know, I loved it because it was like such a script that I didn't expect because, you know, when you see two women in the workplace, you often see them as rivals or going after the same role or spot or job. And then you see them as like 
just to see them as like best friends who were their number one fans and who were supporting each other all the time and sticking up for each other. That was really great to see. Nice. It definitely is a game changer when you two are best friends and also supporting each other as actresses. Um, David, I wanted to see, um, you know, I know that you are part of a comedic role in the, in the show. So I wanted to know what your favorite scene was. <laughs> Well, it's funny. Um, so my being the comedic person, obviously, like I had a lot of fun with like my uh, my scene inside the record store. But I think my favorite scene was actually the dramatic scene, which was kind of funny um, when uh, they, you know, the two friends confront each other because it's just it's so it it was so wonderful because it's so hard to be able to just to confront your friend or, or anyone close to you about problems that you're having. Cause it's like, you're not at fault, but at the same time, please listen to me. It, like, I, I just, you know, I just need you with me. And so like, I love that. Cause I mean, I just, I love friendship. Um, so that was, that was definitely on my favorite, but second would definitely have to be the record store. Cause after we were done, we just, you know, you saw the end credits, or if you haven't, <laughs> wait till then. Um, we got to improv a song and dance, and it was so much fun. I really appreciate you guys coming on here, and I wish that Day Vision, you know, has the best, and I'm proud of you guys for coming and collaborating with each other, and uh, hopping on here with Open Mic. And if you guys have something to say about what your talents are, musically, acting, or even spoken word, just make sure you get contact us at FPTV at admin at faypublic.tv and we'll get you connected. This is Jason Sewell, Anthony, uh, David Anthony, Marissa Dedner, Sarah Wild, and Day Vision's Mike Day and Blair Hastings, and we're signing off. Bye.